Hello everybody and welcome to another redstone tutorial where I do a redstone rail challenge and today we are doing a sugarcane farm. This here is our traditional sugarcane farm. Uh, we know how this all works. This is the uh, observer that observes this going up, the piston that breaks it and the thing. Just turn on the clock and it breaks all the goodies. But what if you don't have an observer? Well, we can make other things. Let me just turn that off. We are going to use rails. We don't also. You don't need to make the clock. You don't need. You don't use observers for the clock or a regular clock. This does it all with the rails, and the observer does it all with the observers. So we're going to come over here, and we're going to build it. So first, we're going to put our water source in. So we can plant our plant. Water source. Then we're going to put our uh, dispenser in. We don't need observers for this. No, we don't. Shift, shift click that. There's our dispenser. And we'll put our plant in. So we cover up the water. It makes it nice and neat. Put our plant in. It's a little slower than that one because it moves, has to move back and forth. Let's put a uh, collection system in right here. I'll put a barrel right there with a hopper into it. Put a rail on top of the hopper. Oh, shift click. And then we put a cart on top of that. There we go. Oh, we gotta get our way out. And that is our collection system. You can uh, do it ha however you want to do it. That is a very simple way of doing this. Next, we're going to put in the breaker, <laughs> which is oddly on the other side of the thing. So we're going to go. Let me uh, do do fill some of this in. We're going to put the breaker on top of this. So we're going to need a piston. This is the breaker. That goes there. And on top of that, we're now going to need some blocks to build off of. Well, we're going to use granite. Or not granite. Quartz. Yeah. We're going to use nice expensive quartz for this. So we're going to put a block here. And a block here. And here. Then, we're going to come over here. Put our rails in. You need about uh, two powered rails, one activator rail, and two regular rails. So we'll put this here. We don't need the water anymore or the pistons. So we're going to put a power rail, activator rail, two regular ones, another activator or powered rail, and one of those. We're going to put a lever on this one. That'll turn that on. When the passes over this, this will start that up. Then we are going to put some redstone dust here, 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 here. And then we're going to get a repeater and I put it on three ticks delay. One, two. So that'll be three ticks delay on the repeater. And then we're going to put some... Pretty much, that's actually it. Uh, you don't want it to spread all over the place, so you might want to put some glass blocks around the stuff here. So you probably want to put a glass block here, here, here. Here, here, here. Here, here, here. This will keep it from just going all over the place. Because these types of farms are a little bit messy. That's one, two, 
three, and that'll keep it from that'll keep it from going out of the place. If it comes this way, uh, use a uh, hopper rail, and it will pick up any extra that falls out this way on top of the hopper rail underneath there, collecting it. Yeah, let's get some stuff in there. Do, 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 do. It's not in this particular section. Let's grab one of these. Fill up our hopper. And we'll just stick this right here. And we'll just push that over there. And boom. There it goes. It's a little slower, but no observers needed. Uh, it will get you all the sugar cane you need. Between the two uh, hopper rail carts, you'll get collect all of it. So it should be zero loss. You get two uh, two pieces per bone meal. So if you like using a lot of rails, this will be the one for you. Uh, so thanks for watching. Uh, good redstoning. See you later. Bye.